Uh, you know, it says Pleasant Journeys, Olga and Daniel. And uh, we've been off the road for a little bit. Yep. What is it, three months? Three months in Hawaii today. Yep. And wow. uh, we're living in Manoa, here outside of Honolulu. And we're uh, going to take a little tour around Manoa Town today. Miss Olga with a Mexican top and a handcrafted crochet edge on her skirt. Yep. Here we are in Hawaii. Manoa. We're up up the hill. Skyline all around. Those clouds produce rains almost daily. And we're taking a walk to the downtown. Okay. What do you think, O? Well, what do you want to talk about? Package? No. Well, it is a good story. Why not? Olga found Lulu online. Lululemon, 90% off. Online store. So we ordered a bunch of stuff. And if you order $40, you get free shipping. So, okay. She's getting fanny packs, socks, underwear, blah, blah, blah. I'm getting a day pack. Well, some days later, it says China Post is preparing your shipment. Some days later after that, it says it's on its way. And it goes to Hong Kong. And then another week later, it's arrived in LA. And another week later, it's on to Hawaii. And it sat, and it sat, and it sat, and eventually it said, delivered. delivered. Only it wasn't delivered. So now we're in the process of uh, recovery. Okay. We dealt with that for an hour. Now we're gonna take a walk downtown and get a little tour of Manoa Town. This is the... the Well, I don't know that it's considered a weed, but it grows like one. I see. I see. There are several things here that you see in passing, like here, Spanish moss. We would see that in Florida. In Florida, it's considered a weed. They buy it and hang it. The world is a fine place. Yeah. Coconut palms, date palms, other kind of palms. This one produces beautiful flowers when it does, as do most things here. And uh, quite often you'll get a rain shower of flower petals. On the next spot to our left, uh, they have a bird feeder. And this is where all the parrots come. And earlier in the day, the hundreds of parrots squawking. kids. <laughs> so as you can see, we're, we're not traveling uh, like the old days, but it's, yeah. I've ordered a, uh, I, Thank you. We're, we're good. Oh, okay. Halloween. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Sucker. No. I'm your neighbor on Kapaloa. You can use this as wrapping material. Mm hmm. I will. Okay. Oh. Yeah, Dakota's on my mind. Okay, so. Alright, this is going to be a long one if we keep going like this. Then we come up to things like this, which even the frame can't capture it. It goes up 70 feet. It's already on the hill.
Mm-hmm. Yeah. Well, I used to say you're gonna <laughs> die one day. <laughs> it's becoming more evident as we get older. I was saying we this isn't as active as the walks we used to take on our, you know, 50 country junket. We're living in Honolulu now, but we still seem to cover eight or 10 miles a day, one way or another. I run to the gym, which is four miles away, three times, three times a day, no, three times a week. Then I go do my workout, then I do yoga in the park, and then I go swim, those are my mornings. So I think we're active. I I walk downhill to the post office and ride the bus to meet Olga later, and uh, I consider that a great success when I accomplish that much. Noon is too soon. <laughs> okay, so we're heading to the downtown Manoa. I'll take a few shots and uh, I'll show you the plaza. In Manoa, lots going on. You see beautiful sights like this. That's a pony palm. In Mexico, they call it elephant's toe because of the big base. Anyway, it's about a 20 minute walk down to the post office in Manoa Town. It's small, quaint. I can catch the bus there, go further in to, towards. Waikiki in Honolulu. We'll have meat Olga. We'll have an adventure, maybe lunch. All right. We reached the steps. Yeah. How many? 66. One year ago. We got 500 something. 52. Oh, we can't about this. Up to our BMB. This is good yeah. exercise. So, continuing down the street now. It's about three quarters of a mile from our place down to Manoa Town. And there's lots to see along the way. Somewhere in here, there is breadfruit. The locals call it Uru. Oh, this is not breadfruit. This is pomelo. And pomelo is like a big pear-shaped grapefruit, only it's a little harder to navigate eating them. Flavor's good. There you go. Okay, we start here at Long's. It's a California drugstore, I think. But they have food items and lots of specials and living in here in Hawaii, it's nice to find specials. And uh, I just see the surroundings are just very pleasant. This little plaza, I don't know that it has a name other than Manoa, maybe Marketplace. I come to the post office almost daily. There's a wonderful playground for the kids. Yesterday we even saw they had a birthday party. In the mornings, the uh, tour groups meet up here. People going out on their adventures, hiking and sightseeing. Cafes, snack shops, Hawaiian style. This is one we've been thinking about, plant-based breakfast. We will try it one day. It's for you, Jasmine. It's laid back, quiet. 
and fun. So as you come out the other side of the plaza, you can see East Manoa Road, bus, and there's the Starbucks. Beautiful building, backdrop of mountains and blue sky. It takes a full five seconds to span the width and breadth of this tree. It's about a six foot diameter trunk and branches extending out at least 30 feet. It's not Manoa, but it is Hawaii. Olga's out there somewhere. Late October, still beautiful. Hey, we're getting on the bus to go home. Oh. Okay, and this is the way back home. You'll see me, I'm on the bus. <laughs> We live in Manoa, an area of Honolulu. Since August, we've been off the road. Little change in our traveling. We're almost on the top of the mountain. It's beautiful, rains a lot.